It was uh, end of season camp uh, away in New York and Chicago. Uh, the first game was against Uruguay, so yeah, it came on for the last maybe 15, 20 minutes. But it was a memorable, memorable day for me and my family, and um, it was a day that I'll never forget. The Hungary game, um, the one all. Obviously, we didn't get a win, but it was such an important game first, um, and we basically put us one foot. Uh, in the finals for, for France, so it's probably the, the game that stood out the most for me. The long balls came up the field and I've won the header. I ran onto it, cut inside, and I remember David Healy shouting and screaming to get slipped through, but I went on myself and um, put one top, top corner, so yeah, it was one of my favourite goals as well. Yeah, it was massive. Um, I think no doubt about it, it was my best campaign. Um, to score seven goals against the teams that we played against in nine games was successful. Like that. I was buzzing on myself, to be honest, but to, to help the team to, to qualify and um, to be there for the first time ever in the Euros, it was, it was an exciting time for us all. Yeah, I'm delighted with everything I've achieved so far. Um, to be second highest goal scorer in the country's history is, is obviously a bonus and hopefully I've got a few more goals left in me. Um, obviously a few more caps, but I think there's been a, a lot of ups and downs. Um, obviously, making making the, the finals in France is probably the highlight. I still get the, the same buzz walking out in Windsor and seeing the fans and hearing the fans sing my name and song. So nothing changes. Um, it's one of the best feelings that you can you can have um, as a young boy and 31, you're you know, 32, and that feeling's still the same. Pulling on that green jersey is one of one of the best feelings you'll ever have.